You probably already know this, but as of the recording of this video, Groove and Product Dino both have some form of lifetime deal, meaning you can pay one time and you get access to the platform to use for the rest of its life. Inside of Groove, again, you probably already know this, but to make sure we're comparing apples to apples and not apples to oranges, Groove comes with all these different apps. We are focused here on Groove Member because inside of Groove Member, this is where you can monetize your knowledge with high impact memberships, or you can create courses and you can upload information, videos, files. And as you can see, Groove Member replaces or is equivalent to Kajabi, Thinkific, Teachable, as well as, not mentioned here, but Product Dino. Again, Product Dino has a lifetime deal, just like Groove as of the recording of this video, and it allows you to sell courses, memberships, and digital products from one platform. Now, this is what it looks like inside of Product Dino. You have products, you have collections, you have global integrations, team members, discussion, direct messages, as well as you have the ability to restrict IPs and emails inside of the platform. But what is it really? It allows you to create products, and these products are essentially courses. So when you go back over to Groove, you go inside of Groove Member. This is where you do the comparison. This is where you're looking at Groove versus Product Dino and the fact that you can create memberships, courses, and portals. Now, portals over inside of Product Dino would be collections. Now, if I scroll down and I show you inside of one of my collections, that would be affiliating. Affiliating is a course I provide where I teach people a simple strategy or the top strategy to build an online business or a profitable online business using affiliate marketing. If you go inside of the content designer, you can see how simple this is to build out a collection of products or courses or offerings that you have inside of the one collection or membership where you have different products. And inside here, you just simply add those products by selecting here and selecting the product that you want. Inside of Groove, you go inside and you create memberships and you create courses. So the idea here is under portals, you would do the same thing. You would create a portal, then you would name this portal, and then you would add memberships to that portal. So really, they actually do the same thing, but they do it very differently. Also, the integrations, I think, are, in my opinion, the integrations that are provided inside of Product Dino to include, if you go back to Groove and you go back to your dashboard, and inside of your Groove dashboard, you have what is called Groove Cell. Groove Sales, where you set up products and funnels to sell. This is a payment gateway. This is where you can actually set up and take payments or collect money for selling your product. Product Dino, when you're actually setting up the product, here we were setting up the collection. If you were to go back to the main menu and you actually setting up your products, you go under Global Integrations, you see here something called Payment Processors. Here you can see I have Thrivecart and ClickBank. There also are other payment processors here, Convertry, Gumroad, Paddle, PayPal, Stripe, and Thrivecart. Again, these are all equivalent to what happens or what goes on inside of GrooveSell over in Groove. Now, there are more here. If you actually go under your products or your collections, and you were to actually select one of your products and you go under Payment Gateways, you'll see that if you add Payment Gateways, there's actually ClickBank, ClickFunnels, ConvertTree, FlipGuardian, GrooveSell. So again, here you see that inside of Groove, the aspect or the function of GrooveSell to take payments is something that Product Dino doesn't have, but Product Dino integrates with GrooveSell, Gumroad, JVZoo, Offline, Paddle, PayKickstart, PayPal, SamCard, Stripe, ThriveCart, Warrior Forum, Warrior Plus, and Zaxia. Now, this is something that you don't get with Groove or Groove Member because Groove Member and GrooveSell are inside of Groove and they work together. So if you want to sell your Groove membership or a membership or a course that you create inside of Groove, you have to do it via GrooveSell if you want it to be automated, meaning that someone makes a purchase and then they are delivered the login URL or the login information after they make their purchase. It's all automated. It all works behind the scenes. When someone makes a purchase, boom, they get an email. Instantly, they have their login details. That all happens inside of Groove with GrooveSell and Groove Member. But again, understand that these are two different aspects inside of Groove, two different things. They're independent, but they work together because it's inside of the one Groove domain or under the same umbrella of Groove. Whereas if you go back to Product Dino, Product Dino has more flexibility, I would say, because you can take payments from any of these payment processors 
And then when someone makes a payment through that payment processor, so if you're using a different cart, you're using Gumroad or JVZoo or your Plus, or you like to use Thrivecart, someone can make the payment. You can set up your sales page. They click the buy button. They make the payment. Boom, they get their information over or the information is sent over to them automatically. And then they can actually log into Product Dino. And Product Dino is where you have your course. Again, that happens under products and collections simply being a collection of products or like what happens over inside of Groove Member. You have your courses that are part of a membership. And then if you want to set up a portal, which a portal is a collection of memberships, then again, underneath that, you have your courses, all your files, and all the information that you're delivering inside of your membership area inside of Groove. So again, go back and look at the dashboard and understand apples to apples. When you purchase Groove, the lifetime or the one-time payment, it is probably 10 times more than what you're paying for Product Dino, but you're getting Groove Pages, Groove Sale, Groove Mail, Groove Member, Groove Video, Groove Blog, Groove Cart, Groove Webinar. Whereas inside of Product Dino, you are simply getting the ability to build products and then add those products to collections and then have global integrations. But I'll also say this, things like global integrations, with marketing emails, your, the ability to send transactional emails, video hostings and files. If you set this up, you have the ability to host with Amazon S3 by FTP or Wasabi. And also you have the ability to add team members. And when you add team members and you invite other team members, you can see here, you can allow access to everything inside of Product Dino to let your team members actually be able to work with you as a team to manage and to assist you or to run the entire project itself if you're using a, a virtual assistant or you have other team members and that's their specific job. Whereas right now, Groove doesn't have that. Now, if you go back to Groove again, I backed the Groove project in May 2019 and I specifically did it because I wanted a cloud-based page builder and I got that with Groove Pages. Now it's called Groove Pages and Groove Funnels. All the rest of this stuff was just a nice to have once they started bolting it on. But understand they are still building. They are still building this out. They started in 2019. As of shooting this video, a lot of these things still lack global integration, I would just say. Like when we're talking about Groove Member and you want to take payments from other gateways, they currently don't have any other way to do it except by a Groove Sale. Now, will they in the future? I don't know, but I think their real selling point or the thing they want to develop and the thing that they want to do is they want to keep everything under the Groove umbrella and they want to make sure that you're looking at Groove Sell as the primary option to sell your courses inside of Groove Member versus Product Dino. Again, if you go back to global integrations and you look here at the different payment processors, they have these integrated with ClickBank, Convertry, Gumroad, Paddle, PayPal, Stripe, Thrivecart. These are the ones that need external integration through things like webhooks versus if you go inside of the product and you actually set up your product and you look at all the different things you can do here inside of the product to include the integrations with email services, webhooks, file hosting. Of course, that includes Zapier. So basically you can do everything and anything you need, but also inside of the payment gateways, you have all these options to choose from that you simply don't get inside of Groove to include Groove Sell, which you can integrate or you can use Groove Sell to sell your products over in Product Dino, and you can actually set up GrooveSell to take the payments and then have the Product Dino products delivered automatically once somebody makes the purchase. So again, at that point, the idea is, or if you're looking at Groove versus Product Dino, or should or do, if I already have Groove, do I need Product Dino? Or if I have Product Dino, do I need Groove? It depends, and it also depends on what you want to set up and how you want to set it up. I think or I know because I've had Product Dino since 2017 and I use multiple payment gateways in my business. It makes sense for me to use Product Dino because it has the ability to take those payments from those different gateways. Therefore, I recommend and that's why I recommend and use Product Dino, but I also have Groove. But primarily, I would say the limited capability of Groove member to integrate with other payment gateways keeps me from using it because you would have to use Groove Cell. And right now I don't use Groove Cell. I don't use Groove Member. When we're talking about Groove, I primarily only use Groove Pages because that's actually what I backed it for was the cloud-based 
page builder. So in my business right now, what I'm doing is I'm using group pages for my sales pages. Then when I actually have someone check out or make payments, I use Thrivecart and then I actually sell my courses or the course content is delivered inside of Product Dino. So like I said at the beginning, you probably already know all this, but I wanted to make this video so you could see the comparison as I see it and also understand when you are comparing Groove to Product Dino or any other product, but specifically when we're talking about these lifetime deals that are currently available with Product Dino and Groove, there's a link in the description to check both those out, by the way. But understand, compare apples to apples, understand that they do have similarities, but they are also very different. If this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it. If you have any questions about Groove or Product Dino, ask them in the comments and I'll talk to you later. Bye.